Hello everyone, it's Angie the Craft NATO, and I'm here with you today to share just a few things. Um, I was contacted by a company for a second time and asked if I would like to show some of their products on my channel. And I had a good experience the first time, so I said sure. And um, they went ahead and sent me over some new products. So I want to share that with you um, through an unbagging. But first I wanted to show you a finished product from one of the items that they had sent me in my first order. So this is a 40 by 40 centimeter square diamond painting and um, I love the way it turned out. I just wanted to show you guys how beautiful this turned out and what you can do and get um, from a budget friendly site and I love it. It's great. So the name of the website is, uh, the name of the store is DP Clubs. And I'm going to put the link in the description uh, because they've done something uh, pretty special for me, I think. And they have given me a code uh, to pass along to you guys for 15% off of your order. So if you'd like to order from this company, DP Clubs, um, the discount code is Angie 15 A-N-G-I-E 15. If you just put that in the field um, in the checkout portion of the website, you'll get 15% off your purchase. So for just for an example, this is a 40 by 40 square diamond painting on the site. This is like 535, I think was the price when I looked last night. And then if you could get 15% off of this, this is I think a beautiful diamond painting um, in that price range and it turned out great and I'm really excited this is going to be a gift for my sister-in-law so I'm going to have this framed I'm probably going to do a little bit more of a professional frame job than what I usually do if it's something that I'm just going to hang in my craft room but I just wanted to show you uh, one of the finishes from a batch from this company so I'm going to set that off to the side and let's get into what I've got that's new. Um, I did have to open just a couple of these uh, to find out who they were from because of the first one I opened. It didn't ring a bell, the company that it came. It, I, I just couldn't think of, of where I had ordered it from. So the first one that we're going to look at, it looks like is another variation on a theme that I've been going with lately, it seems. It seems like when I get on a kick, I kind of want all the things in that genre or in that category. So this is um, a special drill, but it is technically a partial, but not really a partial again. It is another one of those beautiful bubble type diamond paintings with rhinestones. So you have, it's all special drills and it looks like we have some star shaped drills in there. Looks like the center of these circles are gonna be uh, star shaped drills. So we do have some special shapes as well in there with the rhinestones, but it's partial, but it's basically full drill. Um, it's just gonna be with all rhinestones and it's gonna be just different colored rhinestones. These two cats sitting in the moonlight on the hill. And I just thought this was adorable and I think it's something that Maddie's really gonna like. Um, the toolkit that comes with it does include tweezers and anything, everything you need to get started diamond painting. If you're new to diamond painting and you don't have tools, uh, everything you need is in that toolkit. But let's take a look at the drills and see what we've got because I am seeing a beautiful color green. Let's start at the beginning of the strip with our clear crystals. So that's going to go probably in the center or in the moon and in the stars. Then we have some plain black resin drills and I'm sure that's what's going to be the cats themselves. Uh, some dark blue cobalt blue rhinestones some sea blue rhinestones, some lavender, purple, green, and then a darker green. And then we get to the bigger rhinestones in purple, lavender, clear. And then here are our star shaped. So they're, they're clear crystal star shaped drills. They're pretty big too. That's gonna look really cool. Uh, lavender, bigger rhinestones, more than we have a medium size and a large, super large faceted rhinestone in that sea blue. That's going to be in the sky. Um, and then bigger rhinestones in the darker blue, the green, 
another even larger blue and then a larger of that Kelly green. That is such a beautiful deep green. This is going to be really cute. Oh wait, and then we've got more. We've got more green down here. Wow, they've really given me a lot of drills. I don't know that it's going to take that many, but they've given me quite a few drills. So that'll be nice to have for extra. There's just two big packs of these medium size um, lighter green ones. So that'll be great. I like to collect my extra special drills. I don't know what I'm ever going to do with them, um, but I do like to have them around, especially when they're really cool shapes. I always think someday I'm going to think up a project where I can use them. Or, you know, it is fun. I have let my granddaughters um, play with them and put them on uh, sticker paper or whatever. So I just like special drills. I like to see... Um, I like to see all the different shapes and stuff. And with these bubble paintings, it is mostly just multi-sized rhinestones. But this one's kind of cute because it has those star-shaped drills in it as well. So I'm really happy with that. That's the first one that we got. And it is, there are 22 different, wow, that's a lot. 22 different drill colors slash sizes. So that's quite a, that's quite a few. So I'm just going to set that one over to the side and we'll grab the next one and see what it is. And the next one is a full drill diamond painting. And this is a stiffer canvas, which I don't mind. It just means that you're going to have to give it some time to um, relax. I'm going to just roll, roll it backwards so we can get a good look at it. Um, then I'll put it under something heavy for a little while before I drill on it. Make sure that it's nice and flat. I love the gnomes. You guys know that I love the gnomes. And I couldn't resist this one. I have all kinds of Christmas and wintry gnomes. I do not have any fall gnomes. So I just loved this diamond painting. I think it is adorable. And with the multicolored pumpkins down here, you've got a white pumpkin, a gray pumpkin, and a black polka dotted pumpkin, and a striped pumpkin, and all the fall leaves and the sunflowers. And I just think it is so, so super cute. So I will be doing this one definitely this fall um, as a decoration. It's a 30 by 40 with round drills, and it has 24 colors. That's a good amount of colors. And this background, it looks like it's all black, but it's not. It is gonna, you're gonna have some different colors in that. So it looks like you're gonna have, um, and you have all alphabet for your key. So that's nice. I like it when it's an alphabetic key. You're gonna have 413, which is a dark gray, and then B, which is 823. So it's gonna be a dark gray and really navy blue background um, on this. It's not going to be black. Very, very cute. I like that a lot. In fact, there's not much black. Oh, there is some black in the background, I guess, but just a few here and there. Really, really like that. Uh, standard toolkit. And let's take a look at the drills and see what those look like. I love these guys. I want all gnomes. And I, there's only a certain kind of gnome that I like. Um, I can't really describe it to you, but these are that certain kind. <laughs> They're so cute. But, you know, when you're looking for these diamond paintings, I will link the products that I'm showing you. I will give you the direct link to the products in the description of the video. Um, but if you're ever looking for gnomes, um, in the search field, what I've found is a lot of these sites call them goblins for some reason. So um, if you are, want to search for gnomes, type in goblins and you'll probably get better results. Uh, so these drills look really nice and clean. Uh, there's no dust in the bags. I don't see any debris. And they look really good. So we've got brown, red, mint and green and then we have pink black gray like a light green more grays orange three different yellows a beautiful burgundy 
navy, brown, brick, blue, forest green, peach, mustard, and mauve. And those are the 24 colors that come with these adorable fall gnomes. I love them. Now, of course, I can't start this until September because I'm on my no start month. I'm, I'm still, today's the ninth, and I'm still going strong, um, keeping up with my no new starts. So I'm pretty proud of myself. I've held out for nine days. I can't believe it. Can't believe it. I must be going on a record here. All right, so that's the second diamond painting that I ordered from DP Clubs. Let's take a look at the third. The third is also a full drill, and I believe it's also a round. Yes, it is. And this isn't anything, this is a quite different um, from what my normal style is, but it was so cute and so nice and simple and um, just pure looking that I just had to get it. I loved it. It's this adorable little cherub angel child just sitting with his arms crossed. Now this one is printed in the pixelated way where the pixels make up the picture rather than having the picture printed on the canvas and the drill field overlaid over top. So uh, this one is in the in the older way of printing, which I don't mind. This is a nice, simple image. I think it's gonna come out, it's gonna come out beautifully. But I'm just gonna hold these two up to the camera real close for comparison, just so you can really see what I mean. And I'm sure that if you guys are ordering from these types of sites, you're aware of, and you can spot the difference. But I just think it's interesting that, um, they can do it both ways, and it's interesting to see the differences between the two types of printing. So that's probably just me. I'm probably just a weirdo, but I think it's interesting. But I love this. I think it's really cute. It's a 30 by 40, and it has 20 colors. I don't know where they found 20 colors to put in that, but they did. So this background is all clouds, um, so that's going to be all different colors. We have a standard toolkit. And Pam, I promise you, if you're watching, that today or tomorrow I will be taking these to the mail or to the post office and sending them out to you. I promise you that. So and I apologize that it has taken me this long. Um, so we have 3860 and 3861. A couple peaches, a tan. I think that's probably 3371 real dark brown, lavender, dark green, burgundy, brown, two mauves, a gray, a, I don't know, orangish color, a brick color, tan, more burgundy, some black. I would have thought there was more black in there than that, but I guess not. Red and gray. So the drill field key is all in letters and numbers. So that makes it nice and easy for you to um, find the symbols. Well, it makes it, I don't know about you, it makes it nice and easy for me. Um, you do get used to symbols after a while, but it is kind of, it, it, to me it's easier to have numbers and letters. And that is the third diamond painting that DP Club sent to me to show you guys. So let's get into the next one. Wouldn't this be cute hanging in a kid's room? I think it would be, like a baby's room. I think it'd be really cute in a baby's room. Oh, I guess I have more in there than I realized. Okay. Are you stuck? Nope, you're not stuck. All right, let's see what the next one is gonna be. Another full drill, and this one is so stinking cute. This is another full drill round, and as Mindy would say, it's cute, cute, cute. <laughs> she, 
She's, I noticed in her video last week, she was trying not to say cute, 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 and she just couldn't help herself. I thought that was cute, cute, cute. But this is right on time for this upcoming season. And isn't that cute? I love it. I do, I do. Now I'm gonna tell you one thing I don't love about it. It has guide circles. So, um, and they're pretty pronounced guide circles in the lighter areas. Um, all that means is you gotta pay a little bit extra attention when you're placing your drills, just to make sure. Cause I'm a sloppy drill placer. I, so many people are so much neater than I am when they're placing their drills. So I'll just have to pay a little bit extra attention and make sure that I'm covering up the circle with my drill. Not a deal breaker by any means. Uh, this one does have a lot of 310. So this background is mostly 310, but you can see the speckles in it. So you're gonna be interlacing that with white. So it's gonna be black with white speckles in the background. And I think that's gonna give it kind of a cool look. Kind of look like a, like a wash, or like a washed out kind of look. Um, very, very cute, very adorable. It looks like a pumpkin snowman is what it reminds me of. Snowman made out of pumpkins. Standard tool kit. And let's take a look at these drills. I'm sure we know what they're gonna be. We're just gonna have oranges and yellows and black. But sometimes I'm surprised. There's 18 colors on this. Got some sunflowers down there. 18 colors and it's um, there are a couple of symbols in this one. Maybe just one symbol but the rest are alphanumeric. So I see, I wouldn't have expected that lime green and I certainly wouldn't have expected pink. I have no idea where that pink's gonna go. Two, which is Z. Where the heck is that pink gonna go? Oh, there's little pink flowers down here. Okay, all right, I gotcha. Light brown, yellow, three bags of black for that background. Lavender, I'm not sure where that's gonna go either. Probably in the flowers. Red, red, orange, lots of orange, and yellow, mustard, more red, dark brown, green, tan, and white. And that's exactly the colors that I would expect to be in that diamond painting. And it's another one that I'll definitely want to get done for this fall season. Um, September event, as far as events coming up, um, the one that I know of for sure that's going on is the Chuck Along, hosted by um, Maritza from Kiss My Crafts and Mindy's Diamond Moment, and that's doing a Chuck Pinson. Um, in addition to that, I think I'm going to make September my month to work on small guys. 30 by 40s and smaller, um, and knock out some of st knock out some of my stash of small ones because I can do one like this in a like a day a, a day and a half if I'm really cruising. <clears throat> well, depending on how much time I spend diamond painting and not doing other crafts or adulting, I don't try to adult, but sometimes it happens. Now this is one that I couldn't resist and it would be so cute for a new baby um, a new baby's room to hang over the crib I think this one would just be adorable isn't that just so cute I love it now this one is a partial it is a um, regular round drilled partial um, so the only thing that you're diamond painting is the teddy bear but I don't care, I just think it's adorable. I'm actually kind of glad because sometimes words don't come across really well in diamond paintings. So the fact that it says that and it's printed on there rather than diamond painted on there, I'm good with. And I think this will make just such a cute gift um, for someone who's having a baby. So there are seven colors and there are not very many drills at all, um, just because there is so little area that you're gonna diamond paint. And I don't even have to take them out of the package to show you because it's just grays, some teal, some blue, and that's it. Grays, blue, and teal. And that's all, that's all you need. And it comes with just a standard toolkit. And it was a 30 by 30, seven colors. I should have said that. And last but not least, 
let's get into the final one and then I'll let you guys go for the day. And this one is another teeny teeny and another one for baby or a little kid. It's another of the bubble pictures. I'm just loving these little bubble pictures, you guys. Uh, it's 18 by 18 centimeter and this will go to my great nephew for his room. I think I told you guys in another video that he has some of these hanging on his mirror above his changing table and looks at the sparkle while he's getting his diaper changed. So this will go with his collection up there, just a cute little teddy bear. It's adorable. Uh, I don't know how many colors are in there because we don't have a key because it's so small, which is fine. We're just gonna have the baggie or the drills are gonna be labeled with our drill color um, for the, yeah, with our code for the canvas. So let's take a look and see what we've got in there, what colors they're going to be, what kind of drills we have. So we have a lot of clear rhinestones, so that's going to be, and they look really nice, um, probably going to be the background, yeah, number one. So that's going to be all the background, some larger crystals, even larger. And then we've got some of those blue AB coated uh, regular drills, but they're not faceted. They're like round topped. We have gold crystals. Whoops, I'm not even holding them in the camera. Larger gold and then largest gold. And then we have yellow. It's a real pale yellow. And then we have like an amber color crystal, some blue, larger blue, and even larger blue, and then red. Wow, they gave me all this red, Chris, look at this bag of crystals. This is for letter H. There are literally two drills on letter H and they gave you this whole bag of crystals. I'm here for that, I love that. I love having extra crystals laying around. So that was my little haul from DP Clubs. So don't forget to go and check them out and if you do see something that you like, um, don't forget to use the code Angie15 and save yourself a little bit of money off your order. Um, I thought that was really nice of them to offer that. So thank you guys for watching. I will link all of these in the description. If you have any other questions, just feel free to let me know um, in the comment section. I'll get back with you as soon as I can. And in the meantime, until I see you again, um, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And I hope you all have a great day. Bye, guys.